Oh my god, we're on the island now. Where I'm from could never. Good morning, guys. I just woke up. It's like almost 9 a.m. Saturday. I let myself sleep a little bit, but I'm going to Vashon Island today. Gonna go explore it with my mom and sister, see what the vibes are like. Like I said, eventually, I think it'd be cool to build an A-frame on an island. So we'll go check it out. Let's go. I made coffee. I'm really tired still. All right, I just made it to the supercharger, so I'm just gonna do my makeup here really quick for the day. Don't have a ton of vlog battery. See how this goes. This one's also right next to a Starbucks, so I ordered like breakfast at it. So how's it feel? Oh, wonderful. We just still, a couple things have to fall in place, but we feel confident. It's like we have a big salmon on the line and we're really, <laughs> we haven't got it in the boat yet. Yeah, yeah. Soon. Well, let's look at it inside. You haven't been here? I haven't seen it fully staged. Oh, okay. I saw it in the process okay. of the guy staging it. Let's check it. All right, here it is fully staged. Does it come with the dog? Oh, I hadn't seen the stairs yet. They look a lot better. And the railing, isn't that nice? Yeah, I did see the railing. Yeah. And then this bathroom. Nice, nice. Yeah. Then let's see down. How is this room looking? Cool, cool. She did a French kind of theme here. This room looks so much better painted. And then they built a little like balcony thing off of it. Super pretty. Oh yeah, that mirror I bet people will really like. It changes color. Cool. And then so it's you can a do it for the light too. Ooh, the lighting here. Shoot. It's awesome, huh? Wow. It'll keep changing. I want Thing like that. Oh, I know. Sorry, Daddy. And then this feels so much bigger. It before, before you guys, the shower stopped like right here. It was tiny, and now it's huge. So I accidentally left my vlog camera in my car and we're taking my mom's car, but we're in line for the ferry. We're taking a car on, which definitely seems like the move in Tacoma because there's not really like, it's not a walkable area over well, here. Let's see how walkable. Really, kind of, I guess, maybe. There's the boat. We're gonna get on that. This island is much, much smaller than Bainbridge Island, the other island I checked out. So we'll drive to a couple pieces of land because we have a car and get lunch and just check out the vibe. They also have a winery, which I want to take a look at, but I don't really feel like drinking wine, but I just want to see what it's like. On the ferry, it's quite a bit smaller. Don't mind my hair so frizzy um, because I didn't get a chance to do it this morning. This is kind of funny. My sister Vanessa's in town and she went off to go meet up with her friend that lives on this island. My mom put, don't forget Vanessa because we're not used to her being in town. And so, yeah, we don't want to forget her on the ferry. Not that we would, but like, well, it we're just could not... happen though because I'm not used to having her and then we are distracted by all this fun that we're having on the ferry. And the I island. feel like I can't imagine we actually would, but I just think the note is hilarious. Mom. Oh my God, we're on the island. Island, so my mom knows someone who lives on this island so he's gonna let us check out what his property is like and then we'll go get lunch and stuff so this is a really interesting piece of land right here that has this property with it so cool so this land's for sale got some nice mature trees that's a that's a cool tree is that an old boat i'll take it Everybody. It's Sunday. It's about 9 a.m. and I need to clean my place because a lot of people are coming over today. But first, breakfast. Made oatmeal with banana, granola, cinnamon, and peanut butter. Okay, I cleaned my kitchen and I have everything laid out for some cooking. Basically, about a month ago, I invited my brother and his wife and my nephew over to come see like the rooftop and they hadn't been to my place yet. Then I was like, oh, like why don't I just have like my whole family 
family come just for like a casual Sunday hangout. And then my mom was like, oh, I'm gonna invite like our aunt to celebrate all the summer birthdays. And next thing I know, she invited 30 people. I was like, <laughs> um, I'm sure it will be fun, but I was like, okay, I actually though, unfortunately, I feel like I have a lot going on this week. I just cannot take on the stress of hosting. We can have it at my place, but I'm like, I can't do it. And I also just don't want to do it and I didn't sign up for it, so I'm not doing it. So my mom is gonna come and host, but she's gonna host it like on the rooftop here. So she is super excited too, has a whole plan. She's gonna use my kitchen to cook some stuff. Yeah, it's a beautiful day. So it's like honestly perfect day for everyone to hang on the roof. So it'll be fun. And I'm really glad that I'm not taking on the stress of that because I'm just like, it's Sunday. Like this is my expectations were to have like six people over, not 30. <laughs> so didn't really want to because hosting, while it is fun, it's also so much work. It's so much work and like money. You have to buy a lot of food and drinks and stuff. I try to be strategic about when I actually want to do that. I'm sure it's gonna be a fun time. Okay guys, I ordered a new camera, the Lumix Panasonic GH6. I missed my GH5 so much. I just love the color science of it. So this is like the new version of it. I'm gonna try it out and see if I love this one also. It should be like higher quality too. Whoa, okay, this one actually so it looks a lot different than the other one. So it's like a little bit bigger. The way that this flip out screen is, is kind of cool. So I think my adapter for my lenses to use on this camera is in Palm Springs. So I'm gonna go borrow Monica's so that I can actually shoot with it, but we'll get it charging for now. Having avocado toast with an egg for lunch. Are we shocked? Nope. I'm at Monica's looking for the adapter. Let's see here. Got it charging. My parents have basically moved in, brought a bunch of stuff. Uh, no, I'm joking. Solar house, we've got nowhere else to go. Oh my, yeah, that's true. Hey, you're in contract. How's it feel? Like Shelby. Yeah, it feels like we've got a fish on the line, but it's not in the boat yet. Mm -hmm. We've got still like a couple of hoops to jump through, but it feels very hopeful and like a sense of relief. Great. Okay, it's like 3 p.m. I'm doing laundry, I'm sure you can hear. People are gonna be getting here soon ish so i just put on not sweatpants just wearing this all aritzia and then my madewell shoes i'll link these i've linked them before but they're really comfy and i feel like they just look good with this outfit so let's go upstairs and i'm attempting to pawn off all these white claws on people they've been in my fridge and there's just so many and i mean i like seltzers and everything but i'm more of a wine gal i just have these i feel like i just will ever only drink a seltzer if it's like outdoor occasion like at the beach or whatever or like on a boat. Otherwise, I'm like, I kind of like wine better or just like, I'm probably just gonna have sparkling water. I love sparkling water, you guys know. Sparkling grapefruit water. Let's go up. I always forget about this room because there's another one that's pretty cool, but this one, no one has reserved today. So perfect. And it's got like a little kitchen area to get stuff ready. So we can open up these doors and be like indoor outdoor type of vibe. <laughs> Having lunch. I'm out of avocado, sadly, but yeah, I just made this like egg toast thing. Let's shoot a thumbnail. Here's kind of what the thumbnail shot's gonna be. Just have to clean up the background. Don't really want the flowers in the shot. Thumbnail shot ideas. Just did a whole bunch of different ones. I spent 30 minutes shooting these photos, which would be pretty quick for a thumbnail for me. So let's go upstairs and see if any of them are good. working for the day i'm gonna go meet up with a youtuber ask sebi who's in town we've seen each other's videos for a while i'm sure so cool that he's in town we'll go meet up good morning and welcome to a travel day in my life wow first up we have this gorgeous sunrise so pretty i'm packing right now getting ready i'm still very tired we will head to the airport so i gotta charge this camera so catch up with you when i'm done packing gotta head to the airport here in a second but i figured i would do my makeup real quick because i'm not gonna want to do it later <laughs> Be 
become my comfy travel day uniform. <laughs> Decided I'm just gonna take an Uber today because I don't think I have quite enough time to take the light rail to the airport. Also, when you have a checked bag, it's just like not as convenient to have to lug it to a train station, all that, you know. All right, let's get going. to Detroit. First impression, the airport is like really nice. So let's go check out the hotel. All right, I made it to my hotel. I am in the Detroit area. I don't know if I said that. <laughs> this hotel room is so cool. Let me show you guys. So this is the Daxton Hotel in Birmingham, Michigan. Obsessed with this floor tile. So cool. Oh, also they gave me this champagne when i checked in and it's like red let's try it i did not take a sip yet but let's give us give it a try oh quite good pretty sweet wow very sweet the bathroom i'm obsessed with the design of this place it is so cool so this might oh i thought it was gonna be the shower so it's where the toilet is and here is wow cool shower big fan and this is a nice little like dressing table thing and then here's the actual room one thing i think is super cool they did i've never seen this before ever this is a curtain it's like a decorative curtain that's such a cool idea as like a backdrop like wall art type of thing so so cool so this is like such a cool hotel my view isn't the coolest but it's all good <laughs> so i am here in the detroit area for a brand basically gave me exclusive access to the new Chevy Equinox EV. It's electric. So they're actually gonna let me like interview an engineer, which I've never been able to do before with a car brand and get footage of it before it's even like fully announced and everything. So that'll be cool. So I'll be able to post all my stuff about it the day that it drops, which is like awesome. They flew me out here and stuff, but they're not like paying me. So it's not like sponsored. I can say whatever I want. So I'm excited to see it tomorrow it the cool thing is it looks like it will be pretty affordable like starting at thirty thousand dollars for an suv ev which the model y is like 65 so this is like this could be a great win for the electric vehicle space anywho sam will be here soon his flight got delayed but he's gonna help me shoot stuff tomorrow which is so nice of him because he's very busy with his own stuff but he was down i'm looking at this in-room dining menu looks delish but I kind of want to go walk around. This little area is so cool. I'm sure that at least one of you guys watching has like been here or like is from here or something, but Birmingham, Michigan, very cute area. Just feeling fancy. Like they, I wasn't expecting this, but they gave it to me. So I'm like, why not? It was kind of a long flight. All right, I'm going to go on a little walk, explore the area. So let's go see. It looks like there's some stores. There's a, literally a sweet green here. So I'm going to have dinner at the hotel when Sam gets here with him, but otherwise I would totally have sweet green. Like, are you kidding? We don't even have that in Seattle. Like Michigan has it? No offense. I just what didn't expect it. It's a very nice area though. Yeah, let's go walk around. There's a Lululemon. I kind of want a window shop. Let's go. Hey, good morning, everybody. I got room service. This avocado toast looks insanely good. Super cool thing about this hotel, they have like a little pantry area on each floor with free coffee, soda, and snacks. I'll show you guys, because I've never seen this before. Love the archway. Here it is. Honestly, like water and coffee. filming right now with the equinox we're like rushing because we only have one hour with the car but i think we got pretty much all the shots and we're on this cool stage bts of sam back 
back at the hotel, we finished shooting. We only had an hour to get the footage. So they were like, okay, time's up. And I was like, oh my God, I need to get B-roll. So we like got B-roll while they were kind of setting up the car for the next person. But I'll take a look at the footage. And like, I never shoot a video in just one hour. It always takes way more, way more than that. So we'll see, we'll see what I can cut together. But Sam got some awesome shots on his whole setup. I'll show you guys. This is the Black Magic cinema camera, the Ursa, which is like huge and these lenses are like insanely nice. And honestly, like, yeah. I didn't set out to get an Instagram boyfriend, but I hit the jackpot. <laughs> I'm not Instagram, well, Instagram boyfriend. <laughs> That's what people call it. <laughs> no, yeah, no, you're not. What does not. that mean? Like, you met on Instagram? No, no. That, you didn't meet on Instagram. <laughs> no, no, it, it means a blogger where her boyfriend just takes the photos. That's all, oh. that's it. I do know how to do bursts because of you. Yeah, mm. love that. Oh. Anyway. Our hotel had these really cute little bikes, so we're taking them. You know you're in an extremely nice neighborhood when there's just random art. Like what? Where I'm from could never. Look at this place. I've been sleeping on Michigan. This is amazing over here. 